So I just dove into the creek because this thing was moving and you can see it's got like all of this little what looks like leaves and everything collected. I think this is a little critter because look how perfectly the leaves are collected and cut almost into little squares. And if you look down inside, there's a little guy hiding in there. There sure is. And I accidentally plucked out the snail <laughs> at the same time while I was down there. So if you guys know what this guy is, let me know. Because he was in the water moving around. We saw him moving around carrying a seed. Um, and he was he was down in there, so I don't know what he is. I don't want to keep him out of the water in case he is an aquatic creature, so I'm going to put him back in now. But this is one of the most interesting, random, weird, cool little finds I have ever seen. So there you go, guys. Little little tribute from Frog Creek. Oops. Sorry about that. I got so excited. I'm not sure where I lost the video. But here we are. We are back at Frog Creek and the eggs are turning from their tiny dots into little tadpoles. So let me just adjust this so the lighting is just right so you guys can see. It's so hard. Oh, come on little babies. Oh, okay. I'm going to try to get comfy and figure out a way to show you guys this. Hang on. Alright, and we are back here at the little frog creek, and other than that very interesting guy we found earlier, we have not yet seen any frogs, much to my darling's dismay. But, we have found the eggs, and the eggs are actually developed quite a bit. I'm going to see if I can get in just right so you guys can see. You see those guys? Oh, you see them? They're no longer little dots, they're actually itty bitty little baby tadpoles. Isn't that just the coolest thing in the world? And they are swimming around and moving around occasionally. It's really hard to get a good view of them. Oh, I wish I had something. Maybe there's a leaf or something. Mr. Leaf, you want to be our shade? There we go. That actually works out pretty good. But you can see them right under like the shade down there. Oh, hi, little babies. They're little tadpoles, and they do swim around a little bit. They're kind of snoozing right now, so they're not really moving, which is a good thing. But look at them. They're developing. It is going to be so much fun. We might miss the time when they become bigger tadpoles and break out of these little capsules. But they're getting along there. They're on their way to becoming big old frogs. And these eggs, this little pile of eggs over here has also started to develop. I don't even know what the big pile down there has started to do. But we haven't seen any adult eggs. Just that weird like larva thing that was in the creek which was really cool. And I'll try to get more shots of these babies and maybe some of their movement for you guys in just a bit. I just need to find a bigger leaf to provide shade. You guys! Check out this little guy. He has actually broken free of his gel cap. I wonder if this is like the launching. You see him? That tiny little black dot right... Oh, look at him. Right there, the one that's wiggling and moving. He's trying to go back into his egg, but he's actually completely out of the gel caps. And he might be getting ready to move out. So this might be launch time for him. I don't think he's supposed to be... Uh, scooting out just yet but his egg has definitely not provided him with any more protection so he's kind of out in the public look at all these guys I wish I could get them better for you it's very very difficult to get the right kind of lighting out here with the reflective glare and trying not to fall in the creek but you can see he's starting his journey kind of early and all of his siblings more or less are still those black little circles and dots inside of their little egg capsules. Oh, this year is so cute. Look at them. That's just amazing to me. That's just so amazing. But I hope you guys are enjoying these frog updates, other than the fact that they're adorable and they're still doing well in their, their egg capsules. There's not really much more to show you other than look at how invisible that, that whole little micro world. Those dozens and dozens and maybe hundreds of eggs just vanish right away. So, 
I'll keep you guys updated, but this might be lunchtime for some of these babies, so we'll have to keep an eye on them. I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye.